Morningstar Fisherman was just a great place to visit because of the story that's there. And the story is that Morningstar Fisherman, their mission is to spread the good news about aquaponics throughout underprivileged areas and countries of the world. They already have several projects on the go in all sorts of faraway places where they send their staff there and they do it for the people and show them how to do it. They also take in students from all over the place and train them so that they can go back to their country or their underprivileged area and they can do aquaponics for the people. What a great story. I had the privilege of spending a, nearly a whole day there with the manager, Phil Reasons, and his beautiful daughter, Elizabeth, who, who later came and helped us do some of the filming for this DVD, actually. What a great gal she is. And also, what I really counted to be a privilege was spending some time with um, Sigrid and Hans, the founders of Morningstar Fishermen, the people that have held onto this dream for so long and pushed it through the hard times, through the difficult times, to make Morningstar Fishermen what it is today. Well, one of the things that we feel is so important in teaching aquaponics as a sustainable source of food production uh, is a sustainable source of fish feed, because that's the fuel that really gets the whole thing going. And we've been to locations around the world where uh, they have fish ponds or they have tanks already, but they're unable to keep their fish production sustainable because they can't afford the feed. Absolutely. So, I, yeah, I understand that. Yeah, so we've yeah. been able to go in and show them how that they could harvest the filamentos or the duckweed and then growing the moringa. They're able to produce now a sustainable, uh, nutritious diet for the fish and they can grow the food. Phil, I've also noticed you've got some caravans down the back. You guys call them trailers, I think. Absolutely. Is that more student accommodation? We actually have those primarily for interns that come okay. and stay here and mm -hmm. some of our part-time staff will stay here while they're here teaching or training. Okay. So it's just more resident space for our students or for staff or for interns. I'm staying healthier and healthier. Look at that. Look at me. I mean, I'm, 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 I'm moving. You're in pretty good nick, mate. Woo. Yeah. As we'd say in Aussie, you're not a bad specimen, old mate. <laughs> yeah, that's good. So I just I just feel very proud to have been able to come to your place. Yes, thank you. And see you and meet you people because I really feel I'm, meet, I'm meeting some people that are the real deal. And um, Now you know, it's a pleasure for you, us yeah, to meet you too. In the aquaponics world, yes. there's, there's a few people that, that you know that we need to put up there and say these people are the real deal. And you're, real deal. you're one of those, I really believe that. And you know what, you. it's wonderful to do it because it's a great feeling to give. You know, the more you give, the more you...